Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of my family dynamic challenge. My name is Froggy and I do mostly creative sims and let's plays. So if that's the kind of content that you are interested in, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the like button before you leave today. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit the notification bell and check the description box. Don't forget to do all of that before you leave because I definitely want you guys to hang around for future videos on the channel. But without further ado, let's get started because this one is gonna be lots and lots of fun. So it is summer break. We don't have any children um, other than our cute little Arthur here who just asked his dad to take him to the kiddie pool. And oh God, no, do not go smash that. Here, come play in the kiddie pool with Arthur because he's just wandering around and he deserves to have some fun as well but it's been so long since i've played with this family just because i've been obsessed with my sims in bloom so i have to like re assess myself oh thanks for the call babe have a good day i forgot her and anthony are they dating no they're not here let's invite him to hang out we can have him come over as well and just hang out what is this ella okay goodbye ella do we not have a grill back here this entire huge backyard and there's no grill are you kidding me we gotta change that so we're gonna add a grill <laughs> this is like prime real estate for a grill here we'll we'll put it right here i don't know who plans on planting oh what do we have in here so we'll grill some stuff as well i don't know do we have a bar we have to have a bar somewhere in this big house right oh very good very good dove what do you do ma'am is just in her bathing suit okay clean that up oh he's playing with his toy ma'am is your like boyfriend not boyfriend but kind of boyfriend here yeah he's outside are you playing in the trash sir look at them playing in the pool oh my gosh he's dressed nice and cute Oh my gosh, Dove, you too. You look adorable. And then let's, so she needs to do video gaming and programming six and seven. Okay. Let's also send her in here. We'll have her have some fun. We'll do some video gaming. A little bit of summer fun. I love New Crest. Look at this. It's so, oh, right now it's uh, pretty empty. <laughs> pretty empty right now but like we could have come back here and had like a little cookout like it's so cute it's so cute oh my god miss crumple bottom oh she was just thinking about a man who are you thinking about ma'am uh-oh uh-oh oh she said i'm on my phone i cannot be bothered by you get away from me so my plan is Poppy will move out when she, you know, gets good enough to do that. We'll move Poppy out and then like we'll have one room here. We'll keep this as um, the toddler room and maybe we'll move um, Arthur over here and then we'll have like our heir. So I like, I want, you know, I want female heirs. <laughs> so we'll move her over here and then maybe we'll have a toddler or another small bedroom there. Look at them. Oh, hi. I'm delighted to recommend I spent some time with Yasmin. I was amused. <laughs> Very good. Look how cute. Are you kidding? Look how stinking cute. That is such a good screenshot. So cute. Okay, I want them to take a cute selfie together. And she can put like on her nightstand or something. The lawyers remember this cute little like beach day. Man, you don't not you do not need to keep swinging. You are good. She has to compl all right, gosh, you gotta go. You need a lot of work. <laughs> you need a lot of work if you want to level up at work. So let's go ahead and practice programming because we need to do that. Um, so let's stop playing video games, ma'am. We'll practice programming. Oh, look at him outside entertaining himself. Go have fun. I love his little outfit. How cute. Oh, she's home and doing her home. Oh, God, she's on. I forgot she's on probation. She's home doing her homework. No, don't put that on the floor. That's how you lose it. Okay, so she needs to start doing stuff like writing term papers and stuff. So we have to get on that. Let's go ahead and do our homework. I feel kind of. Oh, look at them. So they were close growing up. Um, Dove is a twin. She's twins with Chip. And her and Chip 
you know, were never close. And Chip and Poppy were super close. And now look, they're in here doing their work together, just like living together, being like real siblings. And it's, it's honestly, it's really heartwarming. Oh my gosh, look how popping Newcrest is. Um, it's just it's just really heartwarming to see them interacting with each other and everything like that. We are sending everybody to bed in like the newlyweds they are. They're gonna go ahead and woohoo and they're gonna go ahead and head to sleep. So I will check back in with everybody tomorrow and we will uh, go from there. All right, it is five o'clock in the morning and they are both up doing what they need to do before they head off to work today. I want them to be in great moods, which it looks like they are, so. We love to see it. Oh, he's in a really good mood. Okay. We love, love, love to see that. It's a rainy, nasty day out here, so we're not gonna like do anything crazy. We're gonna send them off to work. You know, the whole drill, the whole nine yards. Oh God, oh God. Let's go ahead and take him to the vet. Oh God, get inside. Ma'am, don't you have work? Yeah, you need to go to work. Thank you. Don't you have work? You need to go to work as well, please. Thank you. Insane, Oh, please come change his diaper. Please, poor guy. <laughs> this is your nephew after all. I forgot, I totally forgot about the baby. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I forgot about him. Uh, he needs a diaper change. Yes, help your niece or nephew. All right, just kidding. Cause she's gotta go off to class. So we'll have to call a babysitter <laughs> and they'll have to come help you. Okay, Poppy is home. I still want her. All right, try to potty train Arthur. I know it's not your thing. I know, ma'am, did you go out in your bathing suit? What, why don't you take this bathing suit off? The poor kitty is sleeping, standing up. I don't know why. Poppy is up here. Oh, look at her. Oh, giving her little nephew a bath. He came out with slippers on. Okay. He has a little backpack. Did I give him a little backpack? I didn't know. Oh my God, so cute. Come play with your dolls. Oh, she's potty training him again. Okay, okay. All right, now that they have their fun, he's come to play with some dolls, which we love. He's gonna have a lot of fun. What happened? Okay, no, I thought he was crying about the dolls. Okay. Oh God, get inside, sir, get inside. You're gonna get struck down. You know what, for shits and giggles, let's take a pregnancy test. I, I can't imagine she's pregnant again so quickly, but we'll have to see. Oh, look at Puppy being a little, a little like, you know, homemaker, taking care of the baby. <gasps> what? Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my god. Let's go share the big news with him. This is like the worst room in the house for like filming purposes. Like, hi, um, we're having a baby, yay! Oh, he's excited this time, okay, good. Yeah, maybe it's because it's not his wedding day. <laughs> it's not uh, his wedding day that he, um... oh my god. So I actually think these two, I think that, um, Poppy is like, so, you know, me and Anthony are, you know, really close now and we want to take it to the next step. We want to live together. Would it be okay if he moved in here? And she's like, oh my gosh, you want, you want him to move in here? Like you want him to move into our home? And she's like, yeah, I think that would be great. And you know, just until I'm done school and then we'll be out and it will be, you know, a lot of fun and you know, all of that. And I think Dub is probably like, um, you know, I have a baby on the way and maybe now is not the best time, but she also wants her sister to do well in school and not have to worry about working or anything like that while she's finishing up school. So in the end, I think Dove is going to be like, yeah, you know what? You can, you can, you can stay. You can invite Anthony to move in with us for a little while. We'd love to have you. And that is just so cute. So Anthony did get the okay to move in if need be. Oh my god, I can't believe she's pregnant again. Exciting. Still very exciting. Okay, so she's not gonna get a promotion tomorrow, so let's just put her to sleep. Oh, the damn ghosts are back. The damn ghosts. I was like, who the hell is in this bed? It's freaking Naomi. Get out of there. No. No, Butterball. 
No. No! Both of them? <gasps> no. No gravy too? Oh my god, no. No. Gravy. No, no. Oh my god, I'm so sad about this. No. Don't take him. I can't believe they both died at the same time. He's still freaking laying down here. No. Oh, death is inevitable. Poppy knows that. Poppy just doesn't think it would... Oh, it would be... There's still so much to do. How will Poppy get everything done if death is just around the corner? There is the other one. We'll have to turn that around when it's time. No! <laughs> Poppy is like, no, not this one too. Oh my god. She's the only one awake to witness all of this. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. And there he goes. Oh my god. We uh, just lost both of our cats. Butterball and Gravy have both passed on. There, there's Clayton, there's Gravy, and there's Butterball. And then there's Naomi and Cliff. I'm so sorry, but it has to be this way. <laughs> Ma'am, you do not need to keep swimming. Go to sleep, please. It's been a long night for you. You witnessed the death of two of our pets. The Grim Reaper is still in here just hanging out. Sir, go away. Oh no, Dove. No, Dove, no. No, don't go cry in the closet. I'm so sorry. Those were her cats. Those were her best, like, little buddies. Oh my gosh. This is the worst. This is the worst day. This is the worst. <laughs> She's gonna go make some scrambled eggs and bacon after she goes to the bathroom. Wow, this day sucks. <laughs> All right, so she's gonna eat some breakfast. He's coming down, he's gonna grab some breakfast. Oh my gosh, everybody is just, ma'am, if you don't stop going in this damn pool, I swear to goodness. This just took a complete turn. I didn't expect um, to lose two pets in one episode, moments from each other. So that's uh, upsetting. <laughs> Let's have her go and do some programming before work. That way she can maybe get, um, you know, some work performance going up. That would be best case scenario since it's been a rough, it's been a rough day. Look at him getting his own little breakfast. Arthur, you're so big. How many days do you have left? Oh my gosh, five. Oh my gosh, and you have like no skills. <laughs> Literally nothing. Okay, sorry. Finally, you're watching my Sims? Like, what are you watching here? They're going to work. Here, you come upstairs, do some as crappy as it is on your day that you just witnessed the death of two of your family pets. Come upstairs and do some homework. Okay, let's go ahead and call Arthur over since we can technically invite him to move in if he wants to do so. So let's go ahead and have him come over. Dove, you are home and you need some serious fun and potentially a shower? Or, do, or did you just fart? I do not know. Come play a game. Come play some Blick Block. You come talk to um, Anthony. Let's go ahead and let's uh, give him a kiss. Oh, she's so, she's so sad. Let's go ahead and try to have him brighten our day and we will let's just chat with him. And so I imagine she's like, so I talked to my sister and she knows that we are getting pretty serious and we want to take things to the next level. And so I talked to her and she said that you can move in if you want. So if you want to move in and if you want to like start a life with me, then we could do that. So he said yes. Okay. So they're going to move in together and we're going to take a... Uh, 30,000 of that and move that over because eventually they're going to move out and they're going to need a place and some money. So great. So he moved in. <laughs> Yay. So now we can play as Anthony. All right. Does he have a job? No job. Okay. Let's get him a job. Let's see his skills. Okay. Very little. 
Okay, let's put him in the military. <laughs> we'll just put him in the military. Military it is. You're off. You're off to the military. Okay. He wants to run on a treadmill. Okay, good thing you brought money with him. You know what? That'll be a good use of this space. We'll make this a little at-home gym. He's so happy to be moved in. Oh my God. She's so happy to have him. Oh, is he going to be an elder today? Ma'am, you keep making yourself miserable because you hate working out and you can't stop swimming. Please stop swimming. Please, for the love of God. Oh, no. She's outside crying about it all. No. <laughs> Stop it. She's just in here talking with Anthony. Like, you know, welcome to the house. We're happy to have you. All of that. So, you know, they're kind of getting along. She'll be in her second trimester in two minutes. Which is very exciting. Very, very exciting. He got her a gift. Just a random gift. How cute cute is that? Oh, big mama. Oh, God. Is that two babies or one? Ma'am, leave him alone. <laughs> Stop talking to him. Okay, Carrie. I mean, I appreciate the nerdiness, but man. Dove and Alexander Goth grew up as good friends. They were part of a video game group and everything together, so he's over visiting and stuff, which is nice. It's good to see that. I didn't know he was that old. Poppy, Poppy, are you sure you want to do this? You know what? This is the first person she ever showed interest in this whole time. Like this whole Let's Play. I've had her date people or attempt to, to talk to them, to do this and that. And Anthony is the first person she actually showed interest in. So I'm not actually going to push it. Like if she wants to be with Anthony, then, then that's who she's going to be with. Maybe the military wasn't the right choice of job for you though <laughs> so maybe we can find something a little less intense i didn't know i didn't know so what if we what if we quit the job like what if we just find something nice and simple you know what like a teacher like a teacher we'll make him a teacher and on that note we'll end this episode here with our stinky baby our elder living in our house now and two of our cats being dead <laughs> if you enjoyed the video always oh, crying i can't take this anymore if you enjoyed the video make sure to give it a thumbs up before you leave come back for future videos here on the channel and yeah i'll see everybody in the next one get ready give me some baby names down in the comments very excited hopefully it's a girl if not we'll have to try again but i will see everybody in the next one bye